Carlos Alberto Pereira is also feeling the heat. Facing criticism that he's turned his back on experienced players such as Matthew Booth, the Brazilian now has one game to rescue South Africa's World Cup campaign. The host faced France in a must-win game. The French, though, appear to be in free fall following the enforced departure of Nicolas Anelka and the subsequent team strike. But Pereira feels little sympathy for his counterpart, Raymond Domenech. It's not our problem. Our problem is to go there, to win the game, and hope there is a, a result positive. One side we win. But I don't know. I, if I was the coach, I, I, I'm not in the situation. I cannot tell what he has to do. Matters for South Africa have been complicated by the need to field reserve goalkeeper Moni Josephs in the place of Itumalin Kune, who was sent off in last week's 3-0 defeat against Uruguay. At the other end of the pitch, Pereira is expected to alter his strike force, who have mustered just a single goal in two games. There will be five, five changes in the team, five, with, including the two which are a red card and yellow card, plus three. With the French squad resembling a shipwreck, it's now or never for South Africa. They need to beat Nebleu by a big margin and hope that the Uruguay-Mexico game doesn't finish in a draw. Otherwise, Bafana Bafana will become the first host country in the history of the World Cup to be eliminated in the group stage.